This year, uh, we, every year we try to look for a theme for our basketball team and sometimes our players come up with it, sometimes I've come up with it. Um, but what would uh, guys that don't know anything about us, if they read the back of our shirt, uh, what would they uh, what would they say? What would they, you know, so usually we try to get something that has a question along with it. I was uh, in a church service, I've been praying about it for a while, and the pastor gave me this theme, or he, he actually, uh, you know, uh, brought this message forth, and, and I took the theme, I knew it was the right one for our team, and the theme is uh, getting the wheelbarrow. And the story goes um, back uh, in the 18, uh, middle 1850s, there was a, a tightrope walker, um, a high, high wire walker that uh, came up with an idea um, to walk across the um, Niagara Falls on a tightrope. And his name is Charles Blondin. And uh, he walked across this a uh, number of different ways. His story is amazing. He, what happened was uh, he walked across this uh, tightrope, the story goes, as the pastor told me, um, with a wheelbarrow and did a couple tricks and he got to the other side and the audience was going crazy and everybody uh, you know, was wanting to do it again, do something you know interesting. So he asked the audience, uh, "How many of you guys want to see me do that again?" And everybody goes crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so he asked for a volunteer to get in the wheelbarrow, and nobody raised their hand. Um, and uh, a lot of people believe God can, but few believes He will. And so our, our goal this year is for our team to get in the wheelbarrow, all in. Believe God will do something special uh, for His glory. Uh, maybe we can go out and, and play our hearts off, uh, do everything we can, hopefully, uh, to glorify Him by playing basketball for uh, SAGU. Represent our school, represent our uh, families, represent Christ, most importantly. Um, so by putting the wheelbarrow on the back and people say, what does that mean? Then we're able to uh, tell them the story and maybe that will uh, bring a little bit of spark to them. I wonder if they're in the wheelbarrow or if they're just on the outside looking in.